we've navigated to Airtable.com and we're at the home screen. So first, we need to create a single place to hold all the details associated with some creative projects our content team is tracking. In order to track and organize all these projects, we're going to need to create a new base. Now, a base, short for database, contains all the information you need for your workflow. So in order to create a new base, I'm just going to hover over, add a base. Now there are multiple ways to get started with Airtable. By selecting add a base, I see a dropdown of three options. I can start with a template, can import a spreadsheet, or I can start from scratch. In today's session, we're going to focus on starting from scratch. So let's select it. And now it's asking me to name my base. So I'm going to call this creative projects. I'm going to change the color and customize the icon. So we can go ahead and jump in and get started. 